Welcome, it's time to back up your project the quickest way, the simplest way, and the right way before you lose any work. You wanna have multiple backups. So going over a quick outline of what we're gonna do and then we'll break down these steps. Most likely, right, you have Visual Studio and Unity open. So the first thing you wanna do is save your scripts in Visual Studio and then you're gonna close Visual Studio out completely. Then, in Unity, you wanna save your scene, save your project, and close out of Unity. Very, very important, you must save your scene and project settings. Then you guessed it, you're gonna close out of Unity all the way. Now that you got everything saved and closed out, then we're gonna find your project folder and compress it into one file, a compressed file. Then we're gonna rename it so you can put the date and then each time you make a backup, a compressed file, you're gonna upload it to your Google Drive or whatever digital storage device you choose. So the first thing you need to know is where did you save your project? So if you don't know where it's saved at, you can open up your Unity Hub and look for your project that you've had open recently. So let's say I wanna back up my Space Explorer game. I can go to the three dots over here and I'm gonna do show in Explorer. Now this is for Windows Explorer. It'll be a little bit different on a Mac, but there'll be some similarities. And we're gonna show in Explorer to find it. Right here, we have the folder that my project is in. Now, this folder here is a total of one gigabyte, 1.07, and it has all kinds of files in it. This whole folder, we wanna compress into a zipped or compressed file to save it. So if we go in here, you can see there's our assets folders that has our 3D models and our audio files and our textures and our images and any other things that we have in there, all of the things that we created, prefabs and particle systems and our scenes and levels, everything's saved in there. But we have other things that Unity uses in these folders that we need as well, right? You don't wanna make the rookie mistake of just backing up your assets folder because that will hurt later on, right? So we wanna go back to our Space Explorer. Oops, don't forget to save all your scripts in Visual Studio and close out of Visual Studio. Then also make sure to save your project and save your scene. It'll either say save scene or save depending on which version of Unity. Save that and close that out. So now that we have our Space Explorer folder, we can right click and we could do send to compressed zipped folder. You'll click that and it'll go through and zip that folder. This is the process of taking those thousands of files and compressing it into a zipped folder. It's kind of like a suitcase that when you're going on vacation, you pack everything in one luggage. So you have everything there and you're good to go. Depending on what software or operating system, you may have a different icon for your zipped file. But it doesn't matter what the icon is as long as you compressed and zipped your file. So here's where we will rename this, add in our date. And I like to do an underscore, I put the year first, so as years go by, you can go back and you can be able to sort it. So if you're working on a project for more than a year, which happens, then you'll be able to have it sorted by year. But then we'll do month and day. So now if I'm missing stuff, either from today or tomorrow, I can easily go back into these files and unzip my files. Your icon will be different depending on if you have special software or you're on Windows or Mac or another operating system, but it will be a zipped one file that has your whole project all together so you are good to go for having a backup. Hey, I hope these videos helped you. We'll see you next time.